Who is it? I think it's Stonewall, ladies and gentlemen. What? Yeah, Stonewall. I think Stonewall attacked. Sky Stanley almost ripped his head off from that moonsault. Now he has to leave. If he can. I don't, I don't think, I don't think these guys want him gone. Yeah, they no, don't want a piece of him. They still want to wait a while. Well, there oh, there he is. Now he's out. He gets to watch the rest of the contest. This is not exactly what we want to plan here, but at least Stonewall gets to go home safely and gets to fight again in the future. Fighting one piece. The man is at, the man is 68 years old after all. The fact of him being qualified for the match is stunning alone. Stunning. May we? Silent. Well, because their beloved fan favorite Stonewall has been disqualified for a, a clumsy mistake. It could have happened to anybody. Give him a break. He's an old man. I, I, I know. I know. That's why I wanted Stonewall to stay in to stay in the match. He was owning this, and now everyone's like, "Oh, well, this is no fun." <laughs> Oh, oh. Try to get the crowd pumped up. And it is what it is. This is uh, this is fantasy pro wrestling fans where anything can happen. Where is those tight shorts? <laughs> I think he's got a sing under, a singlet underneath that hoodie of his. He must. Cod Berry has been nothing but a shit disturber in a way, interrupting most matches on the on FPW Championship Wrestling broadcasts back in the fall when he first debuted. Now at the start of spring, we're not going to see that. Hopefully, we don't get to see more interruptions from Colin. This guy's got a bright future ahead of him. He's got a beautiful girlfriend in Elizabeth. The power couple are in the grand tournament. And I think they're supposed to be competing against the prep boys, members of the Brotherhood. Or perhaps hmm. Alberto Sanchez and the KY. Alberto Sanchez. I'm not 100% sure if it's going to be them. But I know for sure that the power couple are in the tournament. Maybe next month. Again, I'll have to double check that. Yes. Me meanwhile, this four corner gauntlet has now turned into a triple threat gauntlet match. One man eliminated by disqualification. This could be a complete mess. Guys. Wow! That was a neat strike to the jaw and a clothesline. Take that to the bank! I hope that Tradal gets to post more comments. I haven't heard anything back from Tradal in a very long time. It's been months. I haven't- you know what, I'm gonna- I'm gonna speak to him right now. Oh my. Where the hell have you been? Oh my gosh. But I think it's been since Christmas. No, that's not true. There he is. Since the, since the 2nd of March. Of this year? Yeah. Okay. That's good. Not too bad. Where the hell is he? Fuck. Hmm. 
I texted him, where's Tradal? Where is Tradal? Where is Tradal? Where is Tradal? I want to see Tradal. I want to see Tradal. Oh, the referee is down again. I just spotted that now. Oh, the referee doesn't qualify whoever hit him. That's not fair. All right, can this be it? You're pinning the wrong guy, fool. At home with a sick family. Come on, finish him off there, Shane. Finish him off there. Or I'll give you a knuckle sandwich. Knife pitch chopped there by Shane Eaton McKay. Things are going to get very interesting, fans, as we are at 19 minutes into the match. Counting down, that is. And look at that. Stonewall just looking on. So unfair. That clothesline was not meant for Sky Stanley and somehow, some way disqualifies and Now we're on a triple threat situation. The winner of this match gets a crack at the Universal title next month at Cavalcade. I had the flu. I had the flu and we all got something. Even the dog has some, had stomach issues. Not fun, but I'm here for little one keeping an eye on him. And how are you, pal? Since when does he ever use the word pal? Oh, uh, fans at home, uh, sorry for the, uh, this random inter inter interjection here, but Titanium, a superstar here in fantasy pro wrestling, Titanium, is messaging me and I'm actually quoting what he's saying what he's saying on the air. so funny. One. Come on, fuck him up, Cairo. Fuck him up. Fuck him up, Cairo. Fuck him up. Colin Berry, Shane Eaton the cake. Colin Berry, Shane Eaton the cake. Colin Berry, Shane Eaton the cake sucks. <laughs> Stonewall got robbed. Stonewall got robbed. Sounds like the fans are furious. The fans are furious. Shane eating the cake. Fuck! Fans are furious. Shane eating the cake. Fuck! Shane eating the cake. Fuck! The boy Shane, Shane who's <laughs> passed out on the ground, just recovering just now. So is Cairo, slowly recovering. While being counted out, who is being counted out? Uh, Cairo, you better get back in the ring there, buddy boy! And he's back! Before 